while back in Pattaya, everybody's cruising, and the crew are considering other Thai exotica. The young ladies of the town, noticeably approachable. They're making friends rather easily. offer every type of confrontation. With such an example set before a celebrating group of stokers, it's not surprising that one of them soon accepts the challenge. He's a well set up lad and after all, these ties are all so tiny. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Lana would like to introduce you to another name of the boss of this competitor, this legend competitor for this program. From England. A blue corner. This time also, Kai on the room With considerable ringside support, Jim Davis has a distinct advantage in weight and reach. But his opponent's far more experienced at putting the bare foot in. ตอนชกได้ทีมเดวิดเทียนให้ออนชกซ้ายได้ออนตีเข่าซ้ายเจมส์เดวิดจับกระทุ่มแล้วก็เวทีเดวิดสตาร์ทไปไปออนแอร์ซ้ายเดวิดลงทางยืนในทีเดียวได้ออนแอร์ซ้ายไปครับลงกลับกรรมการครับ 2 ชนะเราไปในกลางยกที่ 1 Undismayed by Jim's broken toe and tooth, even larger members of the crew tackle even tinier ties. ยอดผมเดินเข้ามาแตะซ้ายลงตัวยอดผมแตะขวาชกขวาเข้าซ้ายครับอ้าวตัวหมุนออกไปยอดผมกระเตี้ยขวามากนะครับ
A few low kicks and high blows from Mark Broom's tiny opponent. While the QE2 contingent advises on technique and tactics. <laughs> None of it works. Mataya is becoming the new Havana, the harbour where every sailor dreams of coming to rest and relax. aftermath of last night. How are you feeling? Uh, broken toe, split tooth and a uh, headache. Yeah, where's the tooth? Can I see? Yes, right. You're going you're gonna to get it fixed on board? Uh? Uh, well, I have to, yeah. How did you break your toe? Well, uh, I annoyed the fella. I, I was about to throw him off the ring. And the referee said no. And uh, so I dropped him on the floor and I kicked him in the foot. That did it? Well, that annoyed him. Then he kicked me in the face. I see. Well, anybody would, I suppose. Yeah, well, but he was about half your size, of course. Yeah, he's a fit man. Fit man. Well, you don't look bad, Nick. I abuse myself. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about abusing yourself, I'm told this is a pretty good run of show, Patrick. It's the best right, yeah. place I've ever seen. Uh, best yeah. place the best? Yeah. Why? Well, before I got down that street, I've never seen a street like it in my life. And I've been around the world a few times. It's the first time I've been here. Now, what are we talking about? Well, Entertainment. Oh, just, yeah, just look. in general. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look, you've got women, you've got drink, but, you know. You yeah, but haven't you well. got that everywhere? No. Yeah, but it's free, uh, though, isn't it? It's free, there. It's free, yeah. <laughs> Very hospitable people. Aren't they? Yeah. Lovely people. Yeah. The other thing is, you come on here and you do your money in one day. If you were here for four days, what would happen? We'd be skinned after the first day. Uh, <laughs> broke. Yeah, yeah. So, so it's, it's Patia for the crew and Hong Kong for the passengers, really. Yeah, Hong Kong's a good run ashore. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, well, yeah. We'll, we'll just have to borrow money when we get to Hong Kong. <laughs> it isn't often we get an overnight in port, and when they do get an overnight in port, obviously the, you're going to run you a lot. Yeah. So you get two or three yeah. overnights. So say, you, uh, say you're on for three months, right? Yeah. Then you maybe got two or three overnights when you go out for night in that three months. So when you do get ashore, you go.